So we actually see the six months time skip before the Spade Kingdom battle of what Magma and Sora actually did among the six months training training session, which Magma actually begs Sora to teach him how to fight like him. In which, in the Heart Kingdom, his magic was, well, actually weak, but he cannot actually use meta words just like how Luck actually did. So apparently, he actually asked the one person he never actually thought to ask. So he actually asked Sora to actually helping him train. In which, despite the fact that he doesn't actually train someone else, he actually doesn't know why he wanted to train. It's because he actually wanted to become stronger, like how Luck actually got even stronger as well. So we actually see the blank look in his, in his face, and we see how his father gave him the same speech that he actually say. So he actually agrees to tr teach him how to be stronger. So we knew that he actually show him his secret base where he actually have all the researches mm -hmm. that he actually need to find his ultimate self which it actually meant that he actually learned how to use meta words so in the heart kingdom they actually use meta words together on the spot where they actually make part of it in the way that they fight and use that style in any way so now we knew how Zoa actually learned how to use meta words because he's just like Magma, a peasant. But to tell you guys the truth, this is actually how Doctor Strange learned how to use his magic. But the fact that he actually teaching him how to use meta words in his own occurred, he actually spent his days training his best to be stronger, in which become stronger to beat the Spade Kingdom, in which the array that he actually learned is something that he will actually use in his own way. So that's where he actually developed his new spell, which chained the body to his opponent, which is actually stronger than splitting the magic equally. So he using his chain, soul chain deathmatch, which we see how he gave Dante in the present a little tip because he actually revealed that the chains that actually link them together is their very own souls. So that actually means that if someone actually <coughs> try to break the chain off or try to pull it out, it will actually make the victim go insane so they actually had to be careful not doing any of that so we knew how magma actually decided to fight against dante which he using heavy in fighting against magma knowing how he actually doesn't take too kindly of his words and he using presence of the demon king to actually put him on the ground. However, he actually decided to fight back and try to use his magic to actually punch through Dante. But he actually healed himself, which he continued to fight against Magma. But Sora actually knew that he can continue to fight. But knowingly how he actually knew how strong that Magma will become. Which Magma actually said that he doesn't care if he's actually the host of the devil or he is the final boss. He actually is going to win to save Yami. Which he actually heard what actually happened. So we knew how tough Magma really is. So he's actually going to win against his battle against Dante. So we actually see how powerful 
Magma has got since his training with Sora. So we knew how he developed the Soul Chain Deathmatch, which the chain is their souls. So we're going to see how this battle is going to end on the next chapter next weekend. I'm sorry, the next chapter, the week after next week. So anyway, like this video, subscribe for more, and comment what we think about the manga chapter. You guys can also follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Tumblr, and my Facebook page. Until then, this is Anime God joining here saying sign out. Laters and be safe.